A trippy new translucent fish has been found. So this new image of a new weird looking fish really does tell us how much we don't know about our own oceans. This new fish species was found when 40 scientists from 17 different nations went looking in the deep Ata Atacama, I'm gonna say that, Ata, Atacama, yeah, Atacama Trench, uh, and it came back with a snailfish species that no one's actually seen before. This discovery is so fresh, they haven't even given it a name yet. At the moment, it's called Pink, Blue, and Purple, after its colors, very, very original. Anyway, uh, they found this little dude, 7,000, seven, whoa, that's quite a lot. Uh, that's, yeah, 7,500 meters, I'm gonna say. I think I added an extra zero in there. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, they found that un under the water surface. So yeah, pretty, pretty far down. What's also rather bizarre is that the scientists found the fish that don't actually adhere to any preconceived notions of what deep fish should actually look like. This new fish has a perfect structure, which means that it's perfectly adapted to living at extreme pressures. And in fact, the hardest structures uh, in the bodies actually are their inner ear, which give them the balance um, and also their teeth, which is also weird. So yeah, the hardest bones in the air and in the teeth. Anyway, of course, it's no easy task finding uh, these fish in this trench, because, you know, it's a wee bit, it's a wee bit, you know, deep, only a little bit. So finding a new species, uh, it's just as hard to bring them up to the surface. Uh, so the, this procedure takes hours to accomplish, so kudos to the crew for bringing this new species actually to the surface. Let's just hope uh, that there wasn't only one of them, or else that would be very awkward, wouldn't it? Now the fish is on the surface, more studies obviously need to be taken place, and of course, they need to name it. Steve's a pretty good name. Call it Steve, yeah. So what do you think about the new species of fish? Does it look weird to you? Uh, should we have brought it up to the surface, or should we have left it where we found it? Let's have a chat about it in the comments. If you're watching this on Twitter, why not give us a like and a retweet, and to our awesome YouTube family, you know what to do. Thanks for watching, stay classy, scuba divers. We are an online dive store serving the UK and the world for all your diving equipment needs. So why not visit us at simplyscuba.com or click the box on your screen.